Family, we'll put it to us straight. We are being attacked by an unseen enemy. An enemy small that we can't touch with our hands. Frankly, this enemy is trying to kill us. Starts in the air that we breathe. Gets in our throats, removes our ability to speak. Fills our lungs with fluid. Canceling our ability to breathe and to live. Now where most of the world is going into a panic, I believe for the believer, things are different. We faced an unseen enemy all our lives. An unseen enemy that wants to get in our throat, keep us from talking. An unseen enemy that wants to get in our lungs, keep us from breathing. And for the believer, we've come to understand that there's a weapon against this unseen enemy. That weapon is praise. Now, I could give you a feel-good song, but quite personally, I could care less. I want you to get mad enough at this unseen enemy to use your weapon. I need you to get pissed off enough to understand that your praise is what's going to defeat the unseen enemy, the enemy of your soul. Why praise? Because God himself lives inside the praises of his people. But the psalm says in the 24th chapter, 7th verse, lift up your heads, O ye gates. And be ye lifted up, ye everlasting doors. What happens when we do that? The King of glory comes in. The Lord strong and mighty. The Lord mighty in battle. If you want to win this battle, you got to get pissed off enough at the devil to understand and use that praise as a weapon.